It could be the car of the future, a car that uses vegetable oil instead of gasoline. News 8's Leah Lando took it for a spin with permission from students at Webster Thomas High School. It's used at pizza shops, at fast food restaurants to deep fry french fries. And many of you use it at home. I'm talking about vegetable oil. It's great for cooking, but could it someday replace the gasoline in your car? Like, it's not fitting. Students here at Webster Thomas High School say yes, they're converting this diesel-run Mercedes into a car fueled by used vegetable oil. It'll be our, me and my son, our main car. Johanna Campo can't wait for these students to finish their project. Her husband, who is also the teacher of this auto technology class, bought this old Mercedes for her, and when it's done, she will use it to drive to and from work. It's about 25 minute drive, so the the oil is definitely saving us a lot of money. The car, once finished, will have two tanks, one for diesel fuel and the other for used vegetable oil. It's a matter of uh, setting the vehicle up with the various solenoids and hoses and lines, uh, and there's a switch on the dashboard that switches between the two tanks, the vegetable oil and the diesel fuel. The diesel is used to start the car, and once the vegetable oil is at the right temperature, you just flip the switch and... You drive for as long as you want on the free, clean, burning fuel. More people do this to their cars than you may think. Sean Campbell says there is a kit you can order online. It costs about $800 and saves a lot of money on gas. So why doesn't everyone do it? It takes a certain amount of effort to get the fuel, clean the fuel, and to, uh, and to run the fuel in the car. So you're probably wondering how cars fueled by vegetable oil run. I was wondering the same thing, so I took this car for a test drive. It's been operating on used cooking oil for about a year. And it ran just like any other car. The only difference, when I got out of the car, I smelled like a fast food joint. But some would say that's a small price to pay for a gas alternative car that's good for your wallet and better for the environment. Leolando, News 8 Now.